I've been informed of threats being made on Facebook and other things against family members or anything else. Before he even took his seat on the bench, Judge Mark Wall issued a stern warning. There will be no outburst in the courtroom. If you do, I'll find you direct contempt to court and sent you to 30 days on the spot. That warning for the courtroom packed with friends and family of two-year-old Kensley Kenner, her mom's boyfriend, 26-year-old Bradley Young. Felonious assault, felony of the second degree, murder, felony of the first degree. And her mom, 23-year-old Rebecca Kenner, both formally charged in her death. Mr. Kenner, you're charged with permitting child abuse, which is now a felony of the first degree. <laughs> Outside the courtroom, tears flowed as family and friends hugged the toddler's father, who announced her death on Facebook last night. The grieving father also posting, I can't wait to see them get what they deserve, and others feel the same. John Pearson, a Middletown business owner, himself a victim of child abuse, came to court with a huge sign in the bed of his truck, calling for justice for Kinsley. This strikes me real hard at heart because I was adopted as a child, and um, I was taken from my biological family due to abuse and things of that nature. He says he never met the little girl or her family. He's hoping, though, her death saves other children's lives. As a parent and a father of kids, you can't help but feel for this. And if you don't, then there's something wrong with you. We need to join and band together to get this done. And hopefully this is going to make a really large difference. I don't want to see this tragic incident go down in vain for this little girl or this family.